break my neck. Alright, good afternoon class. My name is Bob Darmody. I'm a PhD candidate student here at U of I studying soils. It's not dirt, soils, particularly the pedology. I'm hoping one day I get to go uh, travel and do some study up in the Arctic Circle, up, up north, real far north. Um, are you guys pumped about ET coming out here in a few months? Oh, yeah. yeah, ET! I can't wait. That's going to be pretty neat. I think that might, I don't know if it's going to be a good movie. I think it might just be a big flop. I don't think it's going to go down in history. So, all right, so what we're going to be doing today, we will go outside and we're going to take some uh, bulk density samples and some soil and uh, we'll figure out what the bulk density is. And then we'll also look in the soil for these uh, microorganisms that live within the soil. So the largest type of microorganisms found in soil is a macrofauna, which is greater than two millimeters. So, macroflora is greater than 0.1 millimeters. Next is mesofauna. This ranges from 0.1 to 2 millimeters. Next after that, we have microfauna. These are less than 0.1 millimeters, so they're really, really small. We're going to need a microscope to look at those later. And after that, we have microflora. These are also less than 0.1 millimeters. All right, class, we any, have any questions? Front row guys, how about you? Tom. Uh, so when you're trying to find bulk density, do you use the field weight or the oven dry weight? You want to use the oven dry weight when you calculate bulk density because you just want to know the mass of just the soil particles, which does not include water. Any other questions? All right, well then we'll go ahead and head outside and take some samples. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take some soil samples from here. Um, so we have our soil sample tube. We put inside this thing, like that. We put underneath this thing, what I like to call the plunger. And then we just All right, I that think it's good. all the way. All right, so we'll take this tube out of here. And then we'll get that extra dirt off, or soil off of there. Okay. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> whoa. Let's leave the weapon right there, you guys. And then that's going to be our soil sample for our bulk density trial. All right, front row guys. We're going to figure out how much soil we have here. So we have an empty tube, and we have the tube we have the sample with, with our soil in it. So first we'll get the weight of just the tube itself. All right? So now we have 161.3 grams for the tube empty. Now we'll take the weight of this one and we'll be able to figure out how much soil we have. We have 844.8 grams. So we'll take the soil out of here, put it in this pan, and let it dry in the oven for a day. Alright, so we've about got it all here. Now we'll take it over to the oven to let it dry. Alright, so we're here at the oven. We'll go ahead and slap this in there and let it dry. Go ahead and turn it on. Alright, so we'll come back tomorrow. If you guys want to come over here at 11 o'clock tomorrow morning, we'll go ahead and get our weight in and see what the bulk density is. 24 hours later. Oh, hey guys, how are you doing today? Hey, hey, great. Good, great. Did you guys have a good night last night? Yeah, man, it, was, it was crazy, dude. I did not, because I studied soils. So we'll go ahead and get our soil out. We've been drying for 24 hours. Let me get my glove on, because it's going to be really hot. All right. So we will take this back over to the scale. We'll get our weight for it. Okay, so we're here at the scale. We'll go ahead and get our oven dry weight of the soil. 
All right, it's 648.3 grams. All right, so now we have all of our calculations, or the numbers we need for our calculations. So our formula for bulk density is the up and dry weight of the soil over the total volume of the soil. So here's the oven dry weight we got from our soil, 648.3, and our volume for our tube is 305.81 cubic centimeters. So we'll go over here, take 648.3, 305.81, all right, so does someone want to go ahead and calculate this out for me? Tom. 2.12. Wow, that was fast. So we have 2.12 grams per centimeter cubed. That is our bulk density of our soil.